Grade 4 Math, number 126. This is the last lesson for fourth grade before we move on to fifth grade math. We're going to cover Roman numerals and the Roman numeration system. Look at this right here. This is 2016 in Roman numerals. The M here equals a thousand. This M is another thousand. The X is a ten, the V is a five, and the one is a one. See? When we add them all up together, it's 2016. Because Roman numerals use grouping of adding and subtracting to represent numbers. Here's a Roman numeral chart right here. One line is a one, a V is a five, X is a ten, L is fifty, C is one hundred, D is five hundred, and M is a thousand. So one is one, two lines is two, three lines is three, and there's never more than three. They never group more than three together. Three ones, three, three X's. You always just see three and no more, because then they start subtracting. So if you put it to the left side of the letter, like this one is on the left side of the V, it means one from five, which means four. So when it's on the left side, we subtract. When it's on the right side, we add. So now we know that V is five. That's in our chart. V with a one on the right side means Five plus one is six. Five plus two is seven. Five plus three is eight. One from ten is nine. See that? Then we've got our x is a ten. Our x plus one is ten plus one. Ten plus two for twelve. Ten plus three for thirteen. And then fourteen is an x for ten. And then a one from five for fourteen. See that? Sometimes when you see Roman numerals written, you'll see a line on the top and the bottom. That happens sometimes. You'll see it sometimes. If we put a V to the left of the L, it means 5 from 50, or 45. If we put the V on the right side of the L, it means 5, 50 plus 5, 55. If we put the X on the left of the C, it means 100 minus 10. If we put it on the right side, it means 100 plus 10. See? 110. This number is 1990. It's a thousand, and then the CM means a thousand minus a hundred, and then a hundred minus ten. So the thousand minus a hundred is the nine hundred, and the hundred minus ten is the ninety, which makes one thousand nine hundred ninety. See? Three X's would be ten plus ten plus ten, which is thirty. But two X's and then a one X means ten plus ten plus one from ten, which means twenty-nine. See? They needed to use subtraction because numerals would become way too long without subtracting. This, in the purple, means 1944. The M, right here, means 1,000. And then, the, and then the CM, right here, means 1,000 minus 100. The LX means 50 minus 10. And then the IV means 5 minus 1. If they didn't do subtraction, they would have had to use 14 symbols to represent 1944. It would have been 1,000, then 500, then four one hundreds, then four tens, then four ones. Can you imagine carving that into stone? So they made it very easy for themselves and did a subtraction method so they wouldn't have to carve so much. See that? And they didn't use this numeral system to do math, only to write numbers. For math, they used an abacus. They slid beads on rods to add, subtract, multiply, and stuff. So that's Roman numerals. That's the Roman numeral system. And just remember, to the left means take it away, and to the right means add it on. And now you can write your age and your address and all kinds of stuff in Roman numerals. This is my last video for fourth grade. So I've enjoyed spending this time with you. And I'll see you in fifth grade. Bye.